Greetings. So, I've become addicted to a new type of food, and I thought that would be worth sharing. Let's take a look in the pantry here. Rice. Ready rice to be exact. There's two flavors I really like, the uh, brown and wild and uh, long grain and wild, though I think I may have eaten all the long grain and wild. Now, while this may look like a lot, uh, I actually had this all the way filled to this wall. I had this shelf filled. And I had this shelf filled. So uh, that is uh, not even the tip of the iceberg. But I like these because they're cheap. You just throw them in the microwave for like a minute and a half to two minutes and then they're ready. It's hot, it's filling, it's great. And uh, Target was having a sale where... Um, if you bought 10 of these things at a price that was uh, dirt, dirt cheap, like a dollar fifty a pack almost, if you bought 10 of them, you'd get a $5 Target gift card, and you'd uh, also uh, get a coupon uh, for uh, like a dollar twenty-five off of five bags of rice. Uh, you know, they're trying to compensate for the whole, uh, you know, losing people's uh, debit card numbers and credit card numbers uh, scandal. So I was able to take a couple of runs and just fill up, uh, go to the two local targets and just fill up my uh, cart with as much uh, ready rice as possible. And I've been slowly devouring my way through them. So I have one to two of these a day. In addition to rice, uh, I found two new spices, sort of new, that uh, I loved. Um, the Melting Pot is not a restaurant I go to because I hate cheese, so why would I go to a fondue place? Uh, but my girlfriend really likes it, so uh, sometimes she goes. And uh, she brought back uh, a sample of this stuff, garlic and wine seasoning, which is like garlic, salt, uh, well you can see the... Uh, there, <laughs> garlic powder, citric acid, and wine solids, and it's absolutely delicious. I mean, this whole thing is like five change, and I bought two of them, and this one, as you can see, is uh, almost empty because I use it so much. So I've been pouring this on, like, pretty much everything I eat, popcorn, rice, uh, dipping pretzels in it, anything like that. But uh, that's just absolutely phenomenal. And then um, there's a spice store in Cary, North Carolina called Vom pa Vomfass, and uh, they sell, um, in addition to spices, they also sell like uh, different types of vinegars and uh, different types of like olive oils and uh, cooking oils and things like that. It's a fun little store. And uh, I have uh, jalapeno powder and some other like spice powder and whatever, but um, habanero is uh, quite hot. It's, uh, I think, the hottest uh, chili pepper that's not made from any sort of, like, splicing or uh, artificial stuff. And this was a little bit spicy, 45 grams for, like, 13 bucks. But, um, yeah, I only really need, like, a tiny little pinch of it. I'll just, like, take a little pinch and I'll throw it on, like, the rice and stuff and then mix it up and the whole thing gets a really delicious, nice heat. Uh, just don't get it in your eye. My, uh, my girlfriend actually got some in her eye while driving and she screamed, like, Oh my god! Oh my god! I can't see! <laughs> and, uh, we had to pull it over, and it was just not a fun thing. Or if you get it in your in your nostrils or whatever, then your nose burns. It's, uh, pretty potent stuff, but, uh, used in moderation into a food, it, uh, adds a really, really delicious heat. So, uh, love that stuff. Yeah, spices.